11 years ago when I started this channel, it was a much different time in my life. I was in the sports and I was into wrestling. 11 years have passed since then and I've become a brony. Wrestling is still wrestling, but the video game industry has turned into a corporate cesspool with reviewers neither being subjective or objective. They're being emojective. Focused on emotions and anger and other things of the like. If this is your first time here, welcome. Today is a very special day, as I'm using today to officially reboot the channel. Now, what do I mean by reboot? Meaning, we're going to have a lot more content here. It's been content quiet, and I owe a few explanations, at least. One, COVID. I don't have COVID, nor have I in the last year. However, COVID's atmosphere has been very uncreative and very mentally draining. Plus, after the end of Friendship is Magic, Generation 4 of My Little Pony, I wanted to take an extended break. Just enjoy what was left of the pony material. material and take a step back, seeing that I'd been doing reviews every week for the last five years now, and I plan to get back on that pony, as it were. Not only do we have comics to do, but a new generation has rose above us. And we will eventually get to that in September. That should be fun to do. As far as the wrestling is concerned, Goofy wrestling bullshit will continue, continue starting, I would say, SummerSlam week. That would be, be mostly the video on predictions will take place on August 19th. That's the, that's a couple of days. Before SummerSlam, and then every week after that. And I do plan to have more anime reviews, just like the one I did for Redo a Healer. Now, I can't tell you what review will come next for that. And yes, Kayak reviews will still continue. With video game reviews, most notably, you can expect the yearly Madden review to show up around, uh, let's say, August 23rd or so. I want to give it a few days, and I really want to sit there and play it, although I'll be playing from August 17th on up. Other video game reviews will Come as a when I'm ready for it basis. Video game reviews will not mostly be of the most current material unless it is applicable, like the Madden review. Don't expect any PlayStation 4 reviews un unless I speak otherwise. In other words, if the video shows up and it happens to be a PS4 game, it will be that. Otherwise, it will be from a Xbox Series X perspective, seeing that I have one. Yay. <laughs> so you can expect any amount of reviews coming from there. Most notably, my final review for Streets of Rage 4 
as well as I can guarantee you a review of Hades coming down the line once it gets to Game Pass Ultimate. As far as Tony material goes, comic reviews are going to get done every last comic there is will be done. I guarantee it. And those Generation 4 retro reviews of the first three seasons, I still plan on doing those. Those might be a little bit inconsistent and spotty, but I plan to hit all 63 of those suckers. And of course, when My Little Pony, A New Generation shows up on Netflix, you bet there will be a My Little Pony New Generation review off of the New 26 branding. But the New 26 is also getting new branding. I'm calling it NXP. Yeah, I know. That's not original. <laughs> NXP will be the same as the New 26 reviews and still have the same New 26 format. It will just have a brand new name and hopefully with some time, some free time, with Tyler and such. We can get some new logos, thumbnails, and other things and other accoutrements, including a new channel logo and banner. I hope I can get that done by the end of the year, but I'm not going to guarantee it. As far as Twitch is concerned, Twitch is going to be more of a thing. I'm going to find out how to do it and when to do it, but it's going to be more of a thing. You might see Streets of Rage 4 speed runs with me and Shiva. You might see Hades runs. Maybe my ultimate team in Madden 22. You know, things. I still haven't figured out what I want it to be. And yes, as always, and I don't stress this enough, I am taking requests. If you have any anime, movie, or animated TV show, or even live action Tokusatsu show, because I'm really into that, that you want me to do, let me know down in the comments, or you can buzz me on Twitter at Nirvana Sparkle, capital N and capital S, of course, and let me in on that. I want goofy wrestling bullshit to have more than just me, so if you'd be willing to Discord with me as a co-host, also let me know in that business inquiry. And yes, Halo. All of it. When it comes out. The next year or so will be a dramatic undertaking to Rebuild this channel into something regular and constant, and I plan to stay dedicated to that. You know, it's not because I had burnout or ran out of ideas, you know? It's because I want to freshen this up quite significantly. In fact, if the audio sounds different to you, I'm using a free service known as Voice Mod. So tell me how the Voice Mod thing has helped me out here in this video. The next video, though, is a return of something. I haven't done one of these 
in so many years, but I think I may have found a way to redo them. We used to call them the Scythia Rants around here. They're not going to be called that. But the next video you'll see today is less of a rant and more of a celebration slash slash concern. You know, today is Digimon Day. I'd be remiss if I didn't do a Digimon video. So expect that at some point today. And expect a lot of videos starting up in the next couple of weeks. Maybe the next couple of days. I'm feeling up for it. But until then, I am never on a sparkle. This is... Not one forever, Code Equestria. Find peace in your own nirvana. Thanks for watching. And thanks for sticking around, all you subs. I really appreciate it.